from Columbia, South Carolina, WIS News 10 starts now. Welcome in everyone. As you can see behind us <laughs> happening soon, the 38th <laughs> annual Vista Lights celebration. Dozens of shops, galleries and restaurants will open their doors to show off all of their holiday treasures. Joining us now, Jamal Goss, who was emceeing tonight's <laughs> event. Jamal, I know you emceed this event last year, had such a great time. Looking forward to another wonderful celebration. Absolutely, and especially because the weather is just oh so nice. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Check me out here. You like my gear? You like my cute little puppies here? We're beginning to get in that holiday spirit, and the 38th annual Vista Lights is what it's all about, getting people into that holiday spirit. Families already packing the street behind me that's set to close here in just a moment, but there are going to be so many people out here, and there are going to be so many families out here, and I want to talk a little bit more about what's going to be happening out here with Hal Stevenson. He's one of the organizers here, so Hal, thanks so much for being with us this evening. Thank you for being here. All right, so what can people look forward to when they come down here tonight? Well, you know, this has been going on for well over 30 years now, and we are the entertainment district, so we're putting on a party down here in different places. We have an office party tonight. All the galleries are open. People can walk around in this beautiful weather. And the Christmas season, you really get you in the spirit for Christmas. So it's a great place to come on out. It's not too late. Uh, a lot of things going on downtown, but still, that's what's great. We want everything going on downtown. and. The whole community is welcome. I mean, people think of Columbia and just, it's just the city of Columbia, but people come from all over. Uh, the tri-counties that we have here, the eight counties, whatever they call the Midlands now, um, this is their vista. Yeah. It's the entertainment district for Central South Carolina. Right, so performances are gonna kick off at 6.15. The tree lighting is gonna be at seven o'clock. That's gonna be live right here on WIS. That tree lighting, talk about just what it does to you when those lights go on. Well, so, I mean, a lot of us miss when they do it at State House because, well, there's not a big party going on. But we usually go up on our roof across the street, and when they turn that light on, we would have uh, panoramic um, uh, photos taken yeah. of the whole crowd and the light coming on and videos. And, and so it's like, oh, okay, Christmas is finally here. It's not just after, you know, uh, Halloween and every all the Christmas stuff comes out. I mean, it's really here now, and yeah. we get to really go into that holiday season thinking about family, friends, and fun, and trying to get some work done when we can, but just enjoying the season and being neighbors with so many people coming out. So uh, it's a fun time. Yeah, absolutely. Six o'clock, the road behind me is going to close, 615. The performances are going to start. You have time to get here right on Gervais Street. We're going to be here until 10 o'clock tonight, and then the tree lighting is going to be at 7 o'clock. Again, that's going to be live right here on WIS. So reporting live tonight in downtown Columbia, I'm Jamal Goss, WIS News 10.